so quick one i just want to highlight the difference between next of king and beneficiary a lot of time when we feel when we send forms out to customers there is actually no room for beneficiary details and a lot of customers tends to you know be silent on that part a developer or a real estate company will not put in that details for you it's just few of them that does that okay they will not put it because we they know the mentality of a normal african man you put beneficiary like she you want to kill me any. you want to kill me any. ah i know the person i will hand over to she you want to kill me any. you know so <laughs> they don't they, they actually silent these things and we just felt okay it's time for us to educate customers it's time for us to educate prospects in doing the right thing irrespective of what the developer is bringing as his form okay you can do a letter you can just just immediately after you fill your personal information you fill your next of king information you can also include a beneficiary details to avoid stories that touches the hearts okay so your benefit your next of king is actually somebody that can be reached out to in case of any emergency and that marks the end of that person's responsibility okay don't think if you don't if you do not write a will do not assume in your mind that because you've written that person as next of king is the automatic owner of that property sorry ma sorry sir okay so that person just needs to provide the next accessible or get in touch with the family or inform the family that you are not around you are not available now i'm not even talking about that putting all this information in place it helped the law to take its effect it's so filling in a beneficiary detail is going extra mile to say okay either i'm there or not if need be that this thing has to be taken over without my you know at the cost of my not being available this is the person that i wanted to move to so please investors put in your details for next of king alongside with your form is acceptable it's your form you have paid for the land you can tell them what you want to add to your what you don't want to add to it you can even add it as a form do it as a mail so the company has a mail as a copy of it you also have a copy of it and you don't want to work so hard make the money done the investment and you do the, the the investment you know end up going to the hand of the wrong person please my dear clients my dear investors i want to encourage you to start emulating this act you can start sending letters to all companies you've done investment with as an invest as a smart investor and as, as your real estate consultant i am available to help you if needs if you have done several transactions we're going to help you to put it through you don't need a lawyer to do this okay just do a letter you don't need a lawyer to do it okay so please this is my little tips for you effective from tomorrow 22nd of november 2022 it's city will be selling for 35 million for 500 square meter and 21 million euro for 300 square meter Ituno city is a site and service estate Ituno city has a CEO of who Ituno city is backing the newly approved international airport on the island Ituno city is majorly strategic on the Lekki Airport Expressway. Ituno city is one minute drive to Alaro city. Check out how much they sell lands in Alaro city. Ituno city is well located. There are other properties along that corridor that are affordable. Give us a call. Key in with an initial deposit of 5 million naira, and you'll be glad you did. So give us a call. My name remains Kikelo Moidowu and I'm the lead realtor at Kids Properties. We're a real estate servicing company. We're accessible affordable dependable so we help you in taking the right decision in owning your real estate investment have a pleasant week i wish you a fantastic one i wish you a profitable week and i wish you a great week ahead bye for now